Welcome back to Sluice Juice, the show where we play through a run of the sluice while talking about all of our favorite juices. I'm your host, Dead Kid Gaming. Regrettable research. I'll be your guide, docent, and MC as we cover all things sluice and all things juice. My guests today will be Paracelsus, the Plague Doctor, Dismas, the Highwayman, Audrey, the Wick, uh, the Grave Robber, always a crowd favorite, and of course, Barristan, the Man at Arms. So when we talk about juice, what we're talking about is uh, taking a fruit or vegetable and uh, running it through a blender until it's so juicy that it's really more of a liquid. Rather than a solid. For example, you might take like a banana and a carrot and some spinach and just really really blend that up really fine until it was a liquid and then what you would have is some juice incredible the juice is often run through some kind of a filter to remove um, um a lot of the pulp and fiber and grit make it a smooth juice however Sometimes much of the fiber is left in the juice, making it a pulpy juice. For example, one of the most popular juices in North America and indeed the world is, of course, you know it, you love it, orange juice. An absolute classic, oranges from Florida or California. Or Georgia cut in half run through a squeezer to squeeze out all that juice bottled and delivered to your favorite grocery store the juice is okay uh, let's put the bit on pause for a moment because another thing that's happening in this uh, sluice visit is we're playing around with taunt Audrey so Audrey has uh Audrey has unupgraded shadow fade. On turn 1, she's going to put two stealth on herself and move back two spaces. This gets her ready on turn 2 to use upgraded repartee, uh which is going to give her taunt 2 and dodge plus 3. So right, imagine what happens. We come upon these cultists. Audrey immediately fades into the shadows. Mm -hmm. Barristan, Dismas, and Paracelsus walk up like, uh, like it's a trio, like it's an adventuring party of three. And the cultists are mm -hmm. like, who the fuck are you? And then ambling, sauntering out from around the corner comes Audrey and says, Cult, more like dolt, and uh, they charge her, fully enraged by her repartee. Let's see what it looks like in game. Meanwhile, Dismas is just gonna steal a crit and a dodge. Highway robbery is broken. Change my mind. That's gonna free up uh, our lovely Paracelsus to light everything on fire with chemicals. I've heard chemical weapons are outlawed in warfare, but they are not outlawed on the old road. And of course, Barristan. Barristan is not going to stand fast. He's actually gonna be a damage dealer for a, a minute here. How did I already get a kill? What? 
what? Am, am I that good at this game? I don't remember. I remember being that good. God, look at all of this nonsense. Audrey can't even do anything, so that's a problem with the build. Uh, oops. But, uh, well... She can, uh, scoot forward. Whee! So, uh... Probably need to tinker with that build a little more. Um... Oh, what now? What on earth now? Oh, this is so annoying. I wanted Dismas to crit. Dismas did not crit. I don't know what that first kill was. I gotta go back and watch that. I was too busy talking about juice. That's right, this... Yeah, this is a cultist's encounter in the sluice. Totally possible. Totally a thing that happens. Dodges effectively. All right, now what? Yes, orange juice. You love it, I love it. Orange juice in particular is the perfect example of what I was talking about earlier, where, uh... You can get your juice in a variety of possible levels of pulp. You know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about smooth, no pulp, fully filtered orange juice. I'm talking about the middle path. Some pulp run through a medium fine filter. And of course, I'm talking about what what is it? Full pulp? Lots of pulp? I've seen it a million times. Many, many pulp? The most pulp? So much pulp? Infinite pulp. Excellent work. I, uh, I know I'm gonna lose some followers for this. I like critical. I mean, I like critical 24 death blow. I don't think I'll lose any followers for that. Maybe I'll lose followers for not uh, removing those two stacks of guard. A calculated generosity. What a welcome one, nonetheless. I might lose some followers for revealing that I really like... Um... Pull pulp, or the, the pulpiest one. Most pulp. Uh, that would be my preferred orange juice. I like it at refrigerator temperature, no ice in a glass. But even, um, I'm very picky about brand. Um, I like to get all like snooty and ethical about orange juice, like a total douche. Like, I'm not gonna buy Simply Orange because it's Coca-Cola and Coca-Cola is evil. Like, that's a meaningful, ethical action. I don't know, maybe it makes me feel better. Maybe it just makes me feel icky. An interminable to... conflict. Yeah, yeah. Maybe it just makes me feel icky to, um... Shit, it's on cooldown. That might have changed things, had I known. Yeah, that was... Uh, misplay. Good dodge gets me out of it, though. Love you, odds. Mm -hmm. 
casual 21 points of healing. Twenty-one points of healing into a death blow. Smooth play here at the Sluice Juice. Uh, Uncle Matt's. Uncle Matt's is my uh, preferred orange juice. It's just so good. It's not even about like, oh, Coca-Cola is bad. Uh, it's just uh, Uncle Matt's is better than uh, simply orange. Uh, Uncle Matt's is the best. And, um, it's expensive, but, um, it's not that expensive, and, like, I have a little bit of money, uh, and one of the things that I really like to, um, spend a little more on where I can is definitely is food. Not? I like nice food. It is definitely a priority for me when I have discretionary spending and it's like, what am I going to do with my extra resource. cash? It's like better food, better food, better quality food. Can I, can I afford the nice OJ? Because, uh, you know, I'm here to eat. That's kind of, that's kind of what I'm here for on this planet is to eat food and I want uh I don't know just like eating food I mean food just rules it's so fucking yummy but also like it feels very like human to me it I, I love doing anything that's like oh my god my ancestors did this my ancestors did food and now I'm doing food I'm, I'm in community with a hundred generations of other humans uh I think that's really cool I'm sure my ancestors a hundred thousand years ago also had their choice among orange juices. They had, they had a uh, Walmart and Super Target back then, right? In the Paleolithic. An unexpected find. Welcome back to Juice Sluice, the show where we drink juice together in the sluice. Another bougie Hidden in war douchebag and, and incredible juice. Possibly my favorite see. known juice I'm at the moment. Drink. What what is this? Yeah, I'm here to punch piggies. Crush all who impede. No, what? No, we're punching piggies. No way. What the hell? I, you two, I had you threat. smoke together. All trust is lost. Maybe, uh, maybe smoking together only confirmed for them both how annoying the other was. Business. A promising Coming out pissed. Oh, god damn it. Oh, spit to roast is pretty nasty. That guy was so nasty in Darkest Dungeon 1 as well. That's bad. That weak is bad. Let's just, uh... Attract their attention. The problem with Stand Fast is it doesn't... It doesn't really synergize with her post. Maybe, maybe enough enemy attacks go out such that, uh... Oh my god, indiscriminate science can cure stun! That's a huge play! Is it... I don't know, I like to think so. I wonder if Highway Robbery ever misses. It hasn't missed yet. Including against a bunch of people with dodge. 
This is so dumb. She needs a move that she can use back there. She needs lunge. Um. So, you know, whoops. I guess, um. I guess she can go like this. And then next turn she can taunt. Um. I just, I think maybe she could be put to better use than that. Gotta remember to give her, uh, lunch. Elemental's Grapefruit Juice. Available at the bougiest of the bougie Whole Foods Market. You're welcome, Bezos. Oh, how I hate you. Uh, we'll, we'll get you, get you guillotined before too terribly much longer. Uh, don't you worry. Elemental. Elemental grapefruit juice. Whole Foods Market is the best. It's the best grapefruit juice I've ever had in my life. Uh, love that juice. A simple variable, easily resolved. Hardest, the pulpiest. I gotta get me some. Make sure I'm giving Papa Bezos his fair share. I wouldn't want him to have to downside his second super yacht. That might be unjust. Loathing abates. It might not be fair to ask uh, someone with a hundred billion dollars to drop down to eighty billion dollars so that other people could have their uh, grapefruit juice a little cheaper. That might really be an affront against fairness. We want to be sure that we're being fair to the guy with 90 billion dollars. It's very important that we focus on what's fair to him. The guy who, um... pays his workers starvation wages. It's very important that we be fair to him. The guy where people die in his workhouses, in his warehouses, and uh, nobody notices for three hours. I didn't change the, uh, I didn't change the Grave Robbers move set. You know it. I know it. We all love it. Nice thunderclap grenade, though. I like that very much. Are we gonna get that kill? I hope so. Come on, you know it has less than 4 HP. Oh, it had 5. Is that even allowed? I don't think that's allowed.
Okay, look at this. It ignores stealth and it clears stealth. That's good to remember. People like to put booze with their juice. Then it's the sluice booze juice sluice. Welcome to an all new segment er, 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 called the sluice booze juice, the show where we play through the sluice while talking about different the mixtures of booze and well. juice. Nothing beats a mimosa Sunday brunch. Breakfast on Broadway, jelly, all the best brunch spots. Not snoops, the line is too long. And the food is too sweet. Oh yeah, we make fancy pancakes. We make all kinds of different pancakes. It's just a pancake with like a big old blob of flavored frosting on top. And like, you know, great if you're six and you just want nothing except sugar ever again in life. Uh, casual 20 damage from the Highwayman's Blade. I am in my 30s and I actually don't want to wake up and immediately eat five cupcakes worth of sugar. Uh, how about like maybe some eggs? Anyway, uh, this has been my epic takedown of Snooze and AM Eatery, which, uh, it's one of these places that, like, it's trendy, everybody wants to eat there, and, like, I don't get it. I, not, I, not, not just because of the line, but, like, I, I, I did go one time, and I did wait a while, and I did get a table, and I did get one of their, like, famous pancakes, and it was just, like, a plate of sugar, and I don't want that first thing in the morning, so I don't know why that place is so, uh, heralded. Uh, when I want brunch in Denver, I love breakfast on Broadway and jelly. Isn't there one more? Oh, I love Lucille's. I love Lucille's for breakfast. Yeah, crow's feet are fun, but we did those last episode, and the problem is they're just not very good. Welcome back to Sluice Booze Juice. Everybody loves a mimosa, Sunday brunch, orange juice, and champagne. If you want to punch yourself in the brain even harder, why not try a screwdriver? vodka and orange juice yeah i mean i think i'm i don't know i'm not gonna I'm, i haven't used this because i don't care i want the crow's feet the crow's feet are fun i'm here to have fun oh and i'm here to change audrey's skill what an absolute pro okay so instead of pick to the face we're gonna bring something that moves her forward and that she can use in back which is the definition of lunge all right cool cranberry juice and vodka my mother's favorite drink the cosmopolitan could she be more unoriginal and predictable? Wow, a white female boomer who likes cosmopolitans. Mom, we gotta get you interviewed oh, by the God. New York Times. Soften your gaze. They're gonna wanna write up a piece about you in Vogue. Here. Love you, Listen. Mom. Practice okay, now we're done, improves. right? Oh, wow, we're really done with sluice juice? But we just started. We didn't even get to talk about, um... You can mix juices. You can do, like, a, a sunrise, which is orange juice, grapefruit juice mixed together. Incredible. Apple juice. Apple cider. Apple cider. 
Then there was that guy who did all those famous infomercials for the juicer, and Jim Carrey played him on In Living Color, uh, a historic show in both the history of sketch comedy and the history of, like, black representation in media in America. Uh, if you haven't seen In Living Color, I mean, yeah, it's dated, but, like, maybe check out an episode or two just for your history of comedy, your, your history of, uh, race and media in the United States. Plus, it's a young Jim Carrey, and he's already, you know, he's already good at doing what he's good at. Funny faces, funny body. He's already funny. They're all already funny. It's a funny show in living color. Funny and historic. And there are sketches about juice. So with that, I'm going to bring this episode of Sluice Juice Booze Cruise to a close. I hope you had fun on the Sluice Juice Booze Cruise. Uh, come back for more juicing and sluicing next time uh until then this is deck tech gaming signing off i'll be back next time and i hope you will be too